What's up, ladies and gentlemen? Welcome back to the Game of Charlie. Host of Much Rumble Spicy Blood! And we're back with some FNAF. Ah, five Nights at Freddy's 3. That's right, this is number three. It's about to be up on the channel right after. Fuck you, Spring Track. I'm, ta tra I'm talking, you little bitch. I'll knock the fuck out of you. Actually, you'll probably scare the fuck out of me. Anyway, <laughs> like I said in uh, Five Nights at Freddy's 2, I'm gonna play these until I'm, uh, I die, and then I'm gonna go on to the next one. Fuck you, Spring Trap, you fucking weird ass motherfucker. <laughs> We don't love a good spring trap though, right? I mean, seriously. Anyway, we're gonna jump right into this. In three, two, one, and now. Fosbear Fright, the horror attraction. Local amusement park is getting ready to scare your socks off with a new attraction based on the unsolved mysteries of Freddy Fosbear's Pizza, featuring actual rocket. The fuck? The fuck was that? Oh, already don't like you. How do you? Hey, hey, glad you came back for another night. I promise it'll be a lot more interesting ah. this time. We found some, some great new relics over the weekend, and we're out tracking down a new lead right now. So, uh, let me just update you real quick, then you can get to work. Like, the attraction opens in like a week, so we have to make sure everything works and nothing catches on fire. Uh, when the place opens, People will come in at the opposite end of the building and work their way toward you and past you and out the exit. Uh, yeah, you've officially become part of the attraction. Uh, you'll be starring as the security guard. So not only will you be monitoring the people on the camera as they pass through, you know, to make sure no one steals anything or makes out in the corner, but you'll also be a part of the show. It'll make it feel really authentic, I think. Uh, now let me tell you about what's new. We found another set of drawings, always nice, and a boxy head, which we think could be authentic. Then again, it might just be another crappy cosplay. And we found a desk fan, very old school, metal though. So watch the fingers. Uh, uh, right now the place is basically just, you know, flashing lights and spooky props. Uh, I honestly thought we'd have more by now. Uh, if we don't have something really cool by next week, we may have to suit you up in a furry suit and then walk around saying, boo. <laughs> uh, but, you know, like I said, we're trying to track down a good lead right now. Uh, some guy who helped design one of the buildings said it was like an extra room that got boarded up or uh, something like that. So we're going to take a peek and see what we can find. Uh, for now, just get comfortable with the new setup. Um, you can check the security cameras over to your right with the click of that blue button. Uh, you can toggle between the hall cams and the vent cams. Uh, then over to your far left, uh, you can flip up your maintenance panel. You know, use this to reboot any systems that may go offline. <laughs> uh, in trying to make the place feel vintage, we may have overdone it a bit. <laughs> Some of this equipment is barely functional. Yeah, I, I wasn't joking about the fire. That, that, that's a real risk. Where the, the most fuck are the animatronics? Someone must to keep an eye on them. It's the ventilation. Look, this place will give you the spooks, man. And if you let that ventilation go offline, then you'll start seeing some crazy stuff, man. Keep that air flowing. Okay, keep an eye on things, and we'll try to have something new for you tomorrow night. I don't want new shit. Okay, a little, uh... No, I've never played this one. This is all completely new territory. I haven't, I've only played the second, or the first one on my phone, the second one on my wife's phone. I've never played this one. Period. So I have no fucking clue even where to begin. So I'm probably going to die a lot sooner on this one. They're going to get a lot shorter. Where the fuck? I mean, is that supposed to be Bonnie? I mean, kind of fucking confused. Oh, it's already 4 a.m. Holy shit. They do talk for fucking ever. Oh, I did that to myself. I'm so stupid.
I'm more confused than anything. I don't know where the fuck anything is. Do I have a flashlight? I don't think I do. What the hell is this? Ah, okay, this is where you get croaked off. Okay. Yeah, follow the purple bear, which is actually... I think it's supposed to be Springtrap. Follow me! <laughs> to your fucking death! I'm following you, you little bitch. I know about these little bills because I looked them up because I was curious myself. And error. Yeah, no, I'm trying to leave and I die. Yeah, I don't know who did it. All right, uh, if I if I find it, I'll link that in the description down below because it's really interesting that little lore that goes. Oh sh! Fuck! Scared the hell out of myself. Hey Ouch. man, okay, I have some awesome news for you. First of all, we found some vintage audio training cassettes. Dude, these are like prehistoric. I think they were like training tapes for like other employees or something like that. So I thought we could like have them playing like over the speakers as people walk through the attraction. Dude, that makes this feel legit, man. Oh, but hello, spring trap. Oh, sweet fuck. We found one. Oh, here, go over here. Oh, right. uh, 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 gotta go, man. Uh, well, well look, it, it's in there somewhere. I'm, I'm sure you'll see it. Okay, I'll leave you with some of this great audio that I found. Talk to you later, man. Dude, I don't care. Hello, okay? hello, hello. Uh, over welcome there. To your new career as a oh, performer slash entertainer for Freddy Fazbear's Pizza. Uh, these tapes will provide you with much needed information on how to handle slash climb into slash climb out of mascot costumes. Right now, we have two specially designed suits that double as both animatronic and suit. So please pay close attention while learning how to operate these suits as accidents, slash injuries, slash death, slash irreparable and grotesque maiming can occur. First, we will discuss how to operate the mascot yeah. when they are in animatronic form. For ease of operation, the animatronics are set to oh, no. walk towards sound ease. This is an easy and hands-free approach Making Fucker! <laughs> sneaky, sneaky bastard fucked up my cameras! To change the animatronics to suit mode, insert and turn firmly the hand crank provided by the manufacturer. Turning the crank will recoil and compress the animatronic part around the sides of the suit, providing room to climb inside. Please make sure the spring locks are fastened tight to ensure the animatronic devices remain fixed. We will cover this in more detail in tomorrow's session. Remember to smile, you are the face of Freddy Fazbear's pizza. Well, let me exit already. Shit. Shit, I lost him. Hello? Drive the piece of shit. <laughs> oh, get out of my head for a second. Oh, fuck. <laughs> oh my god. That was horrifying. Oh, I guess I've watched them, but I've never played Five Nights at Race 3 or 4 
or sister location. So, I noticed a recurring trend here. I got all the way to four on the first one, got all the way to three on the second one, and I got to two on the third <laughs> I have a feeling I'm gonna get to two on all the rest of them. Oh my freaking god. Well, like I was saying, I go until I die and then I'll go to the next one. So, <laughs> depending on how short some of these are, depends on if you'll get two first. Ow, I just hurt myself. So anyway, thank you guys so much for watching this episode. If you liked it, go ahead and hit that thumbs up button. I greatly appreciate you. And if you haven't yet, go ahead and subscribe to the channel for more future videos coming out daily. So I'll see you guys in the next video, which is going to be here in a little bit. And peace.